Hey everybody, this is the Happy Cultivator here. And when I'm not doing hydroponic gardening, we do a little bit of soil gardening. And um, today I'm gonna to talk about our irrigation system that we set up. It's more of a poor man's irrigation system. Uh, it's very simple, do it yourself. Um, it consists of a bunch of soaker hoses uh, run through a standard garden hose uh, and then hooked up to a automatic timer uh, directly at the faucet connection. And as you can see, we have a fairly good sized garden uh, that is all being covered by the soaker hose system. And right here we have, I believe is, I believe this is a 50 foot soaker hose. And we have that connected to a, a T connection here. And we, what we've done is we've split off the soaker hose into two segments. One covers this raised, raised bed garden and the other covers this larger raised bed garden. And that has a 75 foot soaker hose and then an additional 25 foot soaker hose hooked onto the end of it. So we've got about 150 feet of soaker hose all running through one standard garden hose and it seems to deliver enough water uh, the flow rate is acceptable and it really simplifies things that way you don't have to go out in your garden and and do the hand watering every single time this just automatically takes care of it for you and so i'll go ahead and show the actual timer unit that we have uh, running this system so you get a better idea of what i'm talking about so here we have the automatic watering timer uh, this particular unit is an orbit timer and they come in various sizes. This is a single connection unit. Uh, it runs on, I believe, a single AA battery. Um, and this particular unit we've been using for at least three years now and it's, it's still going strong. You can, obviously you can see the settings here, but you can type in how long you want it to run for, you set a clock, then you set the start time and then the frequency of how often it runs and then you just turn it to automatic and it will automatically turn on and off. Um, as you can see we have our setup through a Y connection uh, just so we can use the other hose for you know normal watering purposes. Um, all you got to do is leave the the connection to the timer open and then leave the faucet on and the rest will take care of itself. It really simplifies the whole gardening process and makes you not have to spend too much time watering your garden. Uh, so if you want to set up a system like this, it's pretty simple. You can get all the materials you want at your local Home Depot or hardware store, and it really makes life a lot easier. Thanks for watching.